why I want to be t- be able to talk about today floor and ceiling modifications as they relate to being able to put a f- hole in your floor or ceiling. Um, in this case, because I've placed a set of stairs in my floor plan. Uh, if I were to look at this view with my camera, you can see that I have a set of stairs and they are running into my ceiling here. Um, you know, this person is not able to actually traverse from the first floor to the second floor as it currently stands. So there's two things that I need to modify. One is my ceiling that's on my first floor and the second thing is my floor that's on the second floor because that's the two things that you need to be able to walk through. So the first one I'm going to change is my ceiling of my first floor. So I'm going to go to my first floor ceiling plan. I'm going to double click on it here and I want to be able to select my compound ceilings so that I'm able to make some changes. And sometimes you have to change your drawing to wireframe to be able to see um, where all of those different lines are. And so I just am going out kind of over by the edge um, of the ceiling here and I'm going to tab until I get something that says ceilings, compound ceiling concrete. After I get that I'm going to select it so that it turns blue and I'm going to select edit boundary. And then I get my lines up here just like I normally would. Now in this case I'm going to put a hole in my ceiling that goes along my stairs here. So I'm just going to um, use the regular um, tool here and I'm going to make some modifications um, to where those magenta lines are and I'm going to use my extend and then I'm going to do some trimming because again similar to the floor um, you can't have any boundaries that are not overlapping and you can't have any boundaries that have any crossed lines. Uh, I'm just going to move this until it's at my first stair here so I don't fall through the floor and if you remember in this particular plan the floor and the ceiling are touching each other they are the same element essentially and so I would treat this just like I'm going to treat my floor. So you can see that my gent magenta line goes up and around um, my stairs currently and so that and on the left hand side here it looks like I missed the wall a little bit so I'm just going to use my arrow keys to move that into place so that it's in the correct location of where that wall is and once I have that all lined up then I'm going to go ahead and hit check. Now I don't have a ceiling anymore where that was and if I were to look at this shaded um, you can see the modification there um, where the solid line is. So then the second thing I'm going to change is my floor of my second floor. So I'm going to select my second floor and I'm going to do the same sort of a thing. I've changed my view to wireframe so that I'm able to see where my floor is because again the floor is embedded into the wall and so it's difficult to be able to select that if you can't tell where it is. So if I change to wireframe I'm able to see that line very clearly. Floors, IMS, concrete, make sure I've selected the right thing. I'm going to select that. You can see it turns blue and I'm going to select edit boundary and I'm going to do the same thing that I did before and so I'm going to um, create a boundary that goes around my stairs so that I'm able to cut a hole in my floor. And I'm just going to change my view here to thin lines so that I'm able to see where my lines are. And then I'm going to do some trimming on the bottom. So I've got that going up and around my stairs and I'm going to hit check again and it's going to ask me about the floors and if I would like to um, keep those joined or unjoined. So now you can see that when I look at my floor plan on my second floor I can see my stairs um, versus having the floor in the way and if I go back to that 3D view that I created you can see that there's now a hole in my floor and ceiling. These lines that you see in the center there are my AutoCAD plan that's residing on the second floor. So there's floor and ceiling modifications.